Now on to your feed at five. Both the Ohio House and Senate voted to override Governor Mike DeWine's recent veto of Senate Bill 22. That's the one that limits the governor's powers on health orders. Three News investigator Rachel Polanski explains what this means for Ohioans. This hotly contested bill gives lawmakers the power to block business closures, curfews, and other health-related restrictions. So what does it mean to you and me? Well, it will give the legislature the power to cancel any of the governor's health orders that last longer than 30 days. It will also require the governor to renew such orders every 60 days. Republicans call it restoring checks and balances. Democrats call it setting a dangerous precedent. The legislature simply needs to have a, a seat at the table because we are the elected uh, uh, legislative representatives of the people. What this legislation does is put an override by a group, a small group of legislators to be able to say that um, we're going to second guess this and we're going to react to a to a crisis by committee. And I want to mention that this bill passed without any support from Democrats in the House or Senate, which could set up some legal challenges in the months ahead. Rachel Polanski, 3 News.